Robinson Helicopter is the world's most prolific manufacturer of rotorcraft. Last year, the company produced over 800, including the most ever of one type, 664 Robinson R44s. Now, last year, the company announced plans to produce its first turbine-powered craft. Frank, what has been going on with the R66 since last year? I understand it's been doing a lot of flying. Yeah, we're flying it a lot now in the past couple of months or so, and uh, it flies real good. I, it flies just, just like an R44 as far as the pilot's concerned. And, uh, all of its characteristics so far are just what they should be. Okay. Any plans as to when it might actually be joining the lineup? Well, we've got to go through the whole FAA certification program, and that takes a good year. And we're just we're just barely starting that now. Okay. Now I understand last month you had a very a couple of very distinguished visitors at your plant. Oh you yeah. You could tell me about that. Yeah, it was kind of a, a surprise because we got contacted by the White House staff. And they had a, quite a few questions, which we answered. And then they uh, sent a message to me from uh, President Bush that he would appreciate it if I would send him an invitation to come and visit our factory, which of course I did. Now why do you think your facility was chosen for a visit? Oh, no question about it. Because the visit was really to promote some bills in front of Congress to expand our free trade agreements. And I'm sure he felt that, that ours was a very, uh, very good example because we not only produced way more helicopters than any other company last year, but we also exported 70% of the helicopters that we produced. And there are very few American companies that have that type of a export record. So. Now, when we return, we're going to find out what the collapse of Silver State Helicopter means to Robinson. We're speaking with Robinson Helicopter founder and president Frank Robinson. Now Frank, Silver State Helicopter declared bankruptcy on February 4th and they're obviously a very large customer of yours yes. with uh, over 250 of your aircraft already owned and another nine I believe on your production line. What does this mean to your company as far as all these Robinsons that are going to be suddenly available on the market? I don't think it's going to have much effect one way or the other. Uh, I, I can't, and I can't even say that I was surprised when I got, when I got word that they had actually declared bankruptcy. I, I was surprised at the suddenness of it and the, the fact that it was a, a complete bankruptcy. So you'd had some advance warning that the no, company no, might not have been? I had, I had no advance warning at all. But it's all right because we, the way we operate and the way we sell our helicopters, we, we're very well protected. And uh, so it really isn't going to hurt us at all. I just hated to see it go under that way because uh, of the effect it would have on the students that were uh, taking their flight training at uh, Silver State. So I understand you even had some that are already almost ready for delivery with Silver State logo already painted. Well they had the, these uh, Silver State paint scheme on them, yes. Mm -hmm. But it's not a bad paint scheme so I, I don't think there's going to be any real problem selling, reselling those. Okay. Well, good luck with them, and also good luck with the R66. Thank you.